Whoops. What did I do? Okay. Just delete that. Hey, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Cooking Blind with Yolanda. Today, we are going to make a summerlicious, appetizing pasta salad with green apple and crab meat. And I have to thank my aunt Ilse for this beautiful recipe. I had it at her house and I had to have the recipe. So this is my spin on her recipe. So come, put your aprons on, let's get into the kitchen and let's get cooking. Before we get started, I'm going to ask you to please share this recipe with all of your friends and family on every social media platform. Please help me grow my channel. Hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for any future videos. Give me a thumbs up if you try this recipe and you like it. And please always leave comments, I love to read your comments. Now let's get into the kitchen and let's get cooking. So what I have here, what I've done is I have uh, pre-cooked about 600 grams of fusilli pasta. You can use any type of pasta that you would like. If you prefer penne, go right ahead. If you prefer any other cut, go right ahead. I like the fusilli for a beautiful pasta salad. You can also use um, the bow ties. They look pretty as well. So just cook those according to package directions uh, to an al dente uh, consistency so just follow the package directions and the time there so I've cooled them down drained and cooled and what we're going to add to this now is all our fixings so what I have here is about 300 grams of um, crab meat which is I've diced okay so we're going to put all that in looks to be sufficient okay and then we're going to add um, one red bell pepper chopped now I didn't have an entire red one I had half and I had half a yellow so that's what I'm putting in but I'm sure it won't affect the taste there we go then we're going to add, oops, where is, okay. this is what, carrots, cameraman? Okay, we're going to add one carrot, finely chopped. Okay. And we're going to also add two stalks of celery, finely chopped. So you might want to do the uh, chopping prior to you cooking the pasta, just because it's a lot of chopping. Half a red onion. Now, if you prefer another type of onion, again, you're more than welcome to use that. I like the red one. It gives it not only flavor, but also color. Okay, just gonna give it a, a rattle here. And then, lastly, I have one Granny Smith apple, which I have cut up into small chunks. And what I've done is I've squeezed a lemon into it. Uh, so this way it prevents the oxidizing. And you need to put that lemon in there anyway, so. Okay, so we've got that done. Now what we're going to add is about one cup of your favorite mayonnaise. So I'm just sticking to a regular mayonnaise. Okay, 
Now next we're just going to put another half lemon juice. Okay. And we're gonna put two teaspoons of roasted garlic and pepper seasoning. You can also use garlic salt if you choose. This is what I have on hand right now. Okay. One teaspoon of dried parsley. Lastly, we're gonna season with some pepper. Now you could put as little or as much as you want. Okay, and tiny little bit of salt. And finally, we're gonna give it a good toss. Okay, folks, we're just about there. Everything looks nice and creamy and mixed. So that's it. There you have it. A very easy and summerlicious, appetizing crab meat and green apple pasta salad. And I'm going in to taste because this is one of my favorite pasta salads. Delicious. Mm hmm. Got it dead on. Good creaminess from the mayonnaise, tangy of lemon, and you can taste the crab meat and the green apple. So, if you like this recipe, um, please check out my summer herb tomato salad. That is also another wonderful pairing to go with a great barbecue during the summer.